Hello guys, Purple Fairy here. Now, something different today. Everybody knows that once you start collecting something, you're usually a collector of everything. So, I know Christopher collects did stamps to start off with, and um, he didn't get much joy with people watching. Uh, I just want to show you really what what collection of mountain I've got and I dare say Christopher collects mountain is a lot bigger than this uh, it's not really one of my oh that's a nice one not really my first choice of collecting but I don't really know what to do with them I've really got no idea what to do with these. Um, I just thought I'd show you a few. And honestly, don't know what to do with them. I think I've got a lot of Christmas ones. Um, I just keep them in a little box I've got that got something delivered in. I won't show you because it's still got my address on. It doesn't want to come off. Another Christmas one. Oh, one from New Zealand. I very much doubt that there's any of these that's worth anything. Um, some are modern. I like that one. Bert. <laughs> Bert on there and John Lennon. I do like that one. It's purple. And I like that one as well because it's multicoloured. 1969 Woodstock. Three days. Can't read it. But they're lovely. I like them ones. Uh, butterflies. And a wreath, uh, another Christmas one, another. I've seen the folders for these to organise them in, but they're ever so expensive. They really are. No, I, I, I don't know what to do with them, I just keep them in my box. Not really that much of a fan of collecting stamps, but and I'm sure none of them are worth anything, as I said. Uh, another Christmas. Another Christmas. American. Nice one. Oh, that's a tram. Oh, Wallace and Gromit. <laughs> I like that one. Uh, so I've got quite a few from different countries. Um, I just don't know. Another one from New Zealand, put a buy on it. Um, it's just a large English stamp. Another Christmas. One from Denmark here. Belgium I 
Und ja, da. Und da kann ich das. Shekels. Shek. Shesk. Whatever. <laughs> Sorry, I cannot pronounce that. Um, it's a nice one, that's a purple one, South Africa, mm, very nice, now on a treat, lovely bird from Canada, Queen and the large stamp. I'm not going to go through all these obviously because I'm sure you're all bored to tears now. Purple one from Ireland. Christmas. I like that guy. He's cute. <laughs> He's super cute. Christmas, Christmas. I wonder if I could do them into colours, but the old phone there. I've seen some kids on YouTube that uh, the parents put one of these in front of them and tell them to make a call. They've got no idea how to work it. It's quite funny. It really is. They've got no idea what it what it does or. Oh dear. Now, I think, I know some of these are worth some money, but I um, dare say that I don't own one of those. I've got some more of them somewhere. Uh, that's a nice one. I'm trying to not get clear. Yeah, so I've got absolutely stacks of these things. I could do with getting them valued, I suppose. I don't know why. I know there's nothing in there. Just wishful thinking, I think. People have got a lot more than me. A lot more stamps than me. I'd love to see Christopher Glett's stack. That would be funny. Loads on that one. Blue, blue, blue one, that's nice. Got a fairy on it, yay! <laughs> that's a nice one. Oh, I do like that one. Obviously. <laughs> that's a nice one. Nice and warm. Oh, I like that. Oh, that's a nice one. Oh, that's a nice one. Oh, that's a I'm sure I've bored you to tears already. I'm bored to tears being stuck in this bedroom. But, you know, it's got to be done. I just hope it all results and ends people's misery. 
you'd be able to go out and enjoy the sunshine and things. Anyway, that's it guys. I just wanted to give you a quick look of all these stamps I've got. Thank you so much for watching guys. Love you. Bye.